glowing brake rotors and headlights were everywhere in round five and the first ever twilight and night races for the Scottsdale Ferrari Apex Challenge Series, presented by Coffin and Trout. The spectacle and on-track action did not disappoint, beginning with another stout 17-car Radical SR3 1340 field ready to rumble at sunset. Your pole sitters in the gold and silver classes were Chris McMurray and Blake McGovern. McMurray in the new Racer.com livery starting on the front row and McGovern lining up on the inside of the fourth row. A late green hoped to get everyone safely through the first turn. But McGovern had a spin and the third position silver class qualifier Lucky Ludwig tried to dodge the situation, crashing out just seconds into the contest. That opened the door for the ever-improving Evan Wolf to take his first ever race win in any type of racing, followed by Carl Fredrickson and Matt Crandall. Fredrickson now sits just six points behind McGovern in the Silver Class Points Championship. In the Radical Gold Class, hard-charging Jason Plotke snaked from fifth on the grid to second before the first caution. Then he did the same all over again after the restart, since the first caution occurred on lap one, meaning the restart order reverted to the qualifying order. Plotke was all over Gold Class winner McMurray in the closing laps, falling short by just a half of a second. Andy Volkel finished a strong third in his older model SR3 among a gaggle of newer XXRs. The 13-car GT field was headlined by four Porsche 911 GT3 Cup cars, with Jordan Darling taking the class pole over Ralph Ludwig by a scant 0.098 seconds. Darling led the field into the darkness, but it was Chris Hansen who ran a flawless race from fourth position, nailed the quickest lap time and picked up his first ever race win. In GT4, the season-long Audi vs Aston Martin battle raged on between Joey Rainey, Joe Rainey and Matt Williams. The younger Rainey grabbed pole by just north of a tenth of a second over the father Joe and Williams. The trio would finish the race just as they started, and now just 14 points separates this group, heading into the final three rounds in March and April. In time attack, Jordan Sawalka scored the consistency win in his first appearance of the season, followed by points leader Rich Gramlich and Jason Bergelke. In the fastest lap competition, points leader Jeff Koenig took honours for the second time this season, with Gramlich and Bergelke making their second podium appearance of the day, taking second and third. Round 6 of the Scottsdale Ferrari Apex Challenge Series, presented by Coffin and Trout, is up next on March 16. Before we sign off, here's a look at the Provisional Championship point standings, with one required drop factored in. 